Hey everyone, I'm Chase, the Rocky Mountain ATVMC, giving you a closer look at the Rock Fight CE Rooster Deflector from Troy Designs. All right, thank you for checking in. If you are shopping for a Rooster Deflector, one that is very lightweight, comfortable, low profile, minimalistic, then the Rock Fight should be one that is on your list. This is a brand new Rooster Deflector from Troy Lee Designs for late 2020. This is replacing the 5900. I'll admit, I was a little sad to see the 5900 go away because I owned one of those. I've ridden it a lot, very comfortable, very low profile, but they've made improvements. You now have the Rock Fight, which if again, if you're looking for lightweight, low profile, this is a rock solid option. There are two choices available. You have the CE rated version and the non CE rated. Daniel's wearing the CE rated option. I will explain the difference between the two to help you decide which one might be best for you. You got that, you've got two colorways to choose from, black and an all white. Sizing, Daniel here, he is six feet tall, about 190 pounds, little over 40 inch chest. He is wearing a medium large. There's plenty of adjustability on the straps with these, but just use him as a sizing reference. And what I like too is that this puppy gives a lot of coverage in the front as well as the back. Keep in mind, we do have a fit guarantee, so no matter what roots deflector you buy, if you don't like how it fits, send it back in brand new, unused condition. We'll give you free shipping both ways on your first exchange to so make sure you get the size and the fit that you are after. As far as the adjustability goes, you've got your straps down here along the waist or around the rib cage area. Now, one other aspect that I like about the fit is how well it fits the contour of the body. And the way they've done that, I'll undo this buckle real quick, is right here, this piece is floating, so they've split that plastic shield, so it just, is able to wrap around, get a nice snug fit there. So again, when you have this on, especially under the jersey, it's gonna be nice and low profile. Up here in the top, you can see you've got your shoulder straps, and what I like is that they gave you a lot of adjustment here. So it's gonna fit a lot of different body types, and you've got adjustment straps here in the front, also in the back, we'll show you the back here in just a moment. So plenty of adjustability. When it comes to neck brace fitment, Troy Designs made it easy because you do have these shoulder pads here. These are removable, so if you are gonna be wearing a neck brace with this, I would just remove these shoulder pads to get these shoulder straps to sit a little bit lower on the shoulders. You could take them out just because you want to, but easy to remove those if you do. Let's talk about construction. You've got a hard plastic shield, lots of cutouts to get a lot of airflow going through there. Now here's something I wanna point out. The CE rated version and the non-CE rated version are CE certified as a stone shield in the front. So I'm talking about roost, rocks, flying debris, hitting you in the chest, that is a stone shield. With the version that Daniel is wearing, the CE rated option, it is CE certified for impacts in the back. So they have the D3O pad in the back, which will show you, so impact absorption. The non-CE certified option does not have the D3O back pad, so that's the big difference. That's why you're gonna see that price difference, so just keep that in mind. But plenty of coverage here in the front. But what I like too is that, it's gonna be hard to see in the video, but right here in the center, you actually have a strip of EPP, and that stands for expanded polypropylene. EPP is used in a lot of helmets. It's a really good impact absorbing material. What I like though is that it has memory to it, so it retains its shape. So they put a strip of that right here in the center just to give some sternum protection. So if you go down, you have a little bit of you know, impact absorption there. I think about maybe taking a handlebar to the chest. You've got some impact absorption with that sternum pad there. Daniel, face the back for me. So in the back, you can see lots of coverage from the top all the way to the bottom. Underneath the plastic shield, there, there you can see that D3O back pad. That's what makes the CE certified for impacts in the back. Remember, the non-CE rated version isn't going to have that D3O back pad. But as you look at it, what I like, not only do you have really good coverage, but here at the bottom, I like that they split it. That way, this just you know, fits the shape of the back a little bit more. It's not gonna feel like it's really stiff. So as a rider, when you're out there moving around, you want this to kind of work with you and you know, follow the shape of the rider's body. Also, you do have some modularity with this. There's a couple ways you can rock this. The D3O back pad is removable, so if you want to, you could take that out and rock just the back protector or the back shield, or if you wanna go as minimalistic as possible, this whole back plate comes completely off there's a Y strap that they sell. It is sold separately. You can pick that up though. You get that Y strap and it replaces this entire back shield. So you essentially don't have any coverage on the back. So you're just going as low profile as possible. So a few different ways that you can wear this. Face back to the front, Daniel. So last thing I will point out is that underneath the hard plastic on the entire thing, you have their biofoam. It's nice soft padding, very lightweight, very comfortable. I don't think there would be any issue as far as chafing goes wearing this underneath the jersey against the skin. 
And that is it. That is the new Rock Fight Roost Deflector from Troy Designs. They did a great job. It's lightweight, very low profile, great fit, good coverage. If that's what you're after, go check these out. To grab one, you can click on the link or head over to RockyMountATVMC.com. Remember, orders over 75 bucks are free. And if you like this video, do yourself a favor, get subscribed to the Rocky Mountain YouTube channel. We are the best place to go for product reviews just like you saw today along with our how-to videos, our bike builds, all the cool content that we have. So make sure to get subscribed and check it out. I am Chase and we'll see you on the trails.